Hi, in this video I'll show how to use application for converting a word uh, uh, table into word document into light latex table. You can see on uh, my computer I have a document. It's not word, it's word part, but it's um, basically it's showing what is inside of a word document. And you can see I have some table with uh, contact information with emails, name, first name, last name and email and I want to convert this into LaTeX. In order to do this, I will install an um, application from on my website. Uh, to search up, I'll click on search and type word table and it will show me everything uh, converted, uh, all apps that convert uh, from word table. I need this. Um, convert word table and I uh, need uh, word table to latex. Just click on that, <clears throat> click on download to start downloading process and wait until archive will be downloaded. I'll be recording more videos on word converters and um, con uh, into, di into different formats. So if you're interested, please consider subscribing to my channel. Um, as I as I mentioned, uh, Word is or Office is not required or Word part is not required for this uh, application to convert file. I, uh, for example, I don't have uh, Office installed on my computer, but I still can create a, a LaTeX file from that and use this application. So I'll click on Download Archive, double click on MSI Inside Archive, click on More Info here. I'm getting the screen from Windows because I'm not registered publisher with Microsoft. You can see publisher unknown. So I'll just click run anyway to start installation. Click on next, next, install. Click on yes and click finish on final screen. And you can see application has been installed on my computer. Have a new shortcut on my desktop. So now I will close this and this and double click, click on shortcut to launch the app. Conversion is three steps processing. Step one, we'll have to select all tables we want to convert to LaTeX, all, all, all Word document with the tables we want to convert to LaTeX. So in my case, I will click on this button to select input file and I need emails doc and I know that it's in my document. So I navigate to my documents, email docs and click on open, click on next step. A first row of input file has column names, which is mostly, usually tables, first row always has a column names. So I will keep it check, click on next step, and on final step I can preview my LaTeX document or I can save result. So I click on save and it's asking me name and location. Um, so this name and location OK, I will click save and file has been saved. Now let's, for testing purposes, let's uh, launch over leaf. And uh, I have a test project and I can upload file, right? New file, no, upload. Select from my computer, sorting by date. I need this file, click on open. And you can see file has been uploaded. I'll just click recompile. <clears throat> And you can see table is uh, visible, but we need a slight correction and we need to extend the last column size. Let's make it 15 and click on recompile. Yeah, and now it's perfectly uh, uh, shown in here. So we have emails, we have all data and we have all Word document uh, converted to LaTeX. And yeah, basically that's it. Um, then I can save it, download it PDF if I want to with all the thing. And yes, um, if you have any questions, please leave them in comments below. Thank you.